In Antarctica, a team of scientists drills ice for core samples. As the drill descends, the ice cracks, causing the drill to sink. Jason almost falls into the hole, saved by Jack and Frank. Jack risks retrieving samples, but falls, saved by an axe and friends. Jack later warns at a UN conference about a new ice age due to global warming. Politicians dismiss it as sensationalism. Strange weather events unfold worldwide. Jack collaborates with Terry to uncover anomalies, discovering a rapid ice age approaching. Despite warnings, chaos ensues globally. Jack, with his team, rushes to save his son in a frozen New York. The storm intensifies, causing widespread destruction. Jack's calculations reveal 48 hours until the new ice age. Sam and survivors face challenges in a frozen library. Jack, with friends, treks through the storm to reach them. The storm dissipates, survivors are rescued. Jack reunites with Sam, realizing the importance of humanity's future actions. The vice president, now president, initiates a rescue operation. Helicopters reach New York, saving the group and others. The International Space Station observes Earth recovering. As the rescue helicopters airlift the group from the frozen New York, a mix of relief and awe fills their hearts. The vice president, now serving as the acting president, addresses the nation, acknowledging the severity of the situation and pledging significant rescue efforts for those trapped in the northern states. Meanwhile, Jack, Sam, and the rest of the survivors are transported to a temporary shelter in a warmer region. The contrast between the frozen memories of New York and the newfound warmth brings a sense of hope. The global community rallies together to assist those affected by the unprecedented climate catastrophe. In the aftermath, Jack resumes his work alongside scientists and experts to understand the long-term consequences of the rapid climate shift. Governments worldwide commit to re-evaluating environmental policies and adopting sustainable practices. The urgency of the situation prompts a collective effort to address the root causes of climate change. Sam, having experienced the harsh reality of the climate crisis, becomes an advocate for environmental awareness. He joins educational initiatives, sharing his first-hand account to inspire others to take action. The world learns valuable lessons from the catastrophic events, prompting a paradigm shift toward environmental responsibility. Back in the scientific community, Jack's research becomes a crucial foundation for developing strategies to mitigate and adapt to the changing climate. Collaborative efforts lead to innovative solutions, and nations unite to implement measures that prioritize the well-being of the planet. As the years pass, the International Space Station continues to monitor Earth, observing the gradual recovery of the environment. The clear air and stabilized climate serve as a testament to humanity's resilience and its ability to learn from past mistakes. The global experience of facing an imminent ice age becomes a turning point in history. Governments, businesses, and individuals alike prioritize sustainability, fostering a renewed commitment to preserving the planet for future generations. The world emerges from the crisis stronger, more united, and with a shared determination to protect the delicate balance of Earth's ecosystems. Years after the climate crisis, the world undergoes a transformative era of environmental consciousness. Governments implement stringent policies to reduce carbon emissions, invest in renewable energy sources, and prioritize conservation efforts. International collaborations on climate research and technology become the norm, as nations recognize the interconnectedness of their environmental fates. Jack, recognized for his pivotal role in predicting the rapid ice age, continues to advocate for sustainable practices. He becomes a prominent figure in climate science, advising governments and organizations on strategies to safeguard the planet. His work contributes to the development of advanced climate models and monitoring systems, ensuring early detection of any potential threats. Sam, inspired by his experiences, 
dedicates his life to environmental education. He establishes educational programs, writes books, and delivers impactful speeches worldwide. His efforts focus on fostering a global mindset of responsibility and stewardship towards the earth. The next generation grows up with a deep understanding of the importance of protecting the environment. The once frozen landscapes begin to show signs of recovery. Wildlife gradually returns, and ecosystems adapt to the changing climate. Scientific advancements enable the rehabilitation of affected areas, demonstrating humanity's commitment to restoring the balance between nature and civilization. In response to the crisis, new industries emerge, specializing in eco-friendly technologies and sustainable practices. The global economy shifts towards green initiatives, creating jobs and fostering innovation. People embrace a more mindful and responsible approach to consumption, reducing their carbon footprint and advocating for a circular economy. The lessons learned from the near-apocalyptic event lead to a re-evaluation of societal values. Communities prioritize resilience, cooperation, and empathy. International agreements and alliances strengthen as countries collaborate to address global challenges beyond climate change, fostering a sense of shared responsibility for the well-being of humanity. As time progresses, the earth heals and the scars of the past fade. The story of the Near Miss Ice Age becomes a cautionary tale, a reminder of the fragility of our planet and the collective power of humanity to overcome existential threats. The legacy of those who faced the crisis lives on in the sustainable practices, environmental policies, and resilient spirit that define the new era.